So in today's session, I'll be explaining you the term tourist, excursionist, as well as a visitor. So what does tourist means? A tourist is a person or a group of persons who are traveling from their own destinations where they are residing to some unknown destination or be it any familiar destination in order to get away or get rid from the daily hectic schedule of their life. Okay? In order to acquire some leisure time, some pleasure time with the family, friends or whomever their dear ones they want to spend with. It might be for any purpose. But remember one thing, for a tourist to take place, a person has to stay for at least a minimum of 24 hours and not, not at all less than 24 hours. That means one day is minimum and it's must for a tourist to take place. And remember one more important thing for a tourist, that is he or she shouldn't be involved in any kind of earning activity. The main purpose of tourism is what? People are traveling in order to acquire peace, in order to have a good time for themselves, which they are not able to get by working day to day. So in order to get rid from it, they are traveling to some destinations to have a good time for themselves as well as to spend with the dear ones. Okay? So minimum 24 hours, okay, and not less than one day. Remember that's a very important. And also he or she shouldn't be involved in any kind of earning activity. Now next we'll talk about an excursionist. Excursionists are those people who also will be known as a tourist. But remember, for a tourist to take place, he or she have to stay at the particular destination for a minimum of one day. It can be more than that, no issues. But minimum is 24 hours. But for excursionists to take place, he or she have to stay there for less than 24 hours. So this is one of the basic difference between a tourist and excursionist. He or she obviously can travel to any places he or she wants. But remember, staying is not at all permitted. Because if staying will be permitted, that person will be known as a tourist. That is the basic difference between a tourist and an excursionist. Now, what will we call a visitor? A visitor will be a person who will be going to any places. But a visitor will also or might also be involved in any kind of earning activity. Okay, a person visiting daily basis or a person visiting any destination on weekends or whatever you can say for three, four weeks also, but he or she can be involved in some kind of earning activity. So this is the basic difference between a tourist and excursionist as well as a visitor. So I hope you are understandable, you are able to understand by the term visitor by the term excursionist as well as by the word known as tourist. Thank you.